Hello there, everyone. Zantaku with Slickster Game, and welcome back to more Pokemon Shining Pearl. You all ready for a gym battle? Because I am. Uh, we've got our team leveled up just a bit here. I've got Biscuit and Lop up to 18, and I figured that's probably good enough, especially since Biscuit is going to be super effective against the grass types in this gym. It's like, ah, you know what? That's fine. And if they need a little bit of help, we can swap in Pennywise. Uh, who has actually no flying type moves, so maybe not. I don't know if we'd swap in Pennywise. We would probably swap in, um, probably Melina, honestly, because we know Melina's strong. But let's go ahead and uh, get in the gym and see what, see how this gym's gonna go. Hey there, how's it going, Chapter B? Actually, that's what I said to some boy who stepped in here earlier, too. The gym leader guy Dini has a use of grass top Pokemon. It should be obvious, but Grass-type Pokemon really hate fire. Oh, wait a second. I should tell you about the gym itself first. You can't shout out the gym leader until you find and beat all the gym's trainers who have hidden themselves. It's a bit challenging, but just think what is a good trainer and go for it. Alright, sir. At my gym, no one gets to battle with the gym leader, me, until they've beaten all the other trainers. I'll be waiting for you in the back. Good luck, challenger. I like Gardenia. It's a maze of trees! So yeah, we gotta find all the other trainers here, fight them, beat them up. Uh... Hello, strange looking trees. Oh, I thought somebody would be behind these trees and that's that would be the indicator, like, oh, there's going to be somebody by these trees. Nope, okay. I guess those are just there to be there. Huh. Alright. Can I go? Yes, I can go through here. But there's nothing here either. Where are the traders? Gardenia, where are your gym trainers? I looked in two spots that I thought should have been obvious. But there ain't nothing. Okay, I'm starting to get concerned. Oh, hey, I saw somebody. Hey, you! How'd you know where to find me? Fine, let's have our battle. The last Caroline. Caroline? Caroline. Caroline. Eh. It's one of the two. Use Flame Charge Biscuit! A Roselia easily can burn that. Ah, level 19 for Lop. One more level and Lop will have Double Kick. Which will be very good to have so they have more than just normal type moves. Okay, the next train is at the end. Pass the two boulders, I think. Oh, do I have to fight them in order? Uh. All right, well, there's the two boulders. So they should be over here. <laughs> My grass type Pokemon can dole out some serious special attacks. I won't let you win easily. Good. Make me, make me fight for it. Ooh, you got three. All right. Sorry with a Badoo, though. I don't think that's going to be too good. Pretty sure I'm going to beat that. Do 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 do. It died. 
But I'm poisoned, so that's not ideal. Not a fan of that. So you're gonna send out another Badoo? Yeah, we'll keep Ponyta out. Use Flame Charge! We just keep increasing our speed. We will be the fastest horse on the planet! Maybe, wait a minute that. But we'll be the fastest Pokemon in the gym. That I feel pretty good about saying. It looks like the poison taking 6 HP each turn. That's fine. Level 19! Alright, where's the next trainer, Jenna? Oh, that's right. A hint about the next trainer. In the middle of three trees. That's it for my hint. Good luck. We know where that is. We checked that spot earlier. Oh wait, there's another one of the three trees right here. Don't think it's that though, considering we don't see anybody. Kind of knowing that you have to fight them all in order, but whatever. It's fine. Yeah, you were not here before. Even when you try to conceal it, you can't hide the aroma of flowers. I mean, I think fire would do a pretty good job with that. The smell of uh, burning grass or smoke. Pretty sure that'd cover up the scent of flowers. Not that I've, you know, burned down a forest or anything. Just, you know, I think... I'm pretty confident, you know. Uh, you miss with Iron Tail. That would have been good to hit me with, too. Torchwick has Iron Tail this early on? Damn. Alright. You don't really have much of a tail, but okay. Yeah, she's like, oh yeah, just like how you can't conceal your abundance skill, like, oh, that's a really weird way of saying that, but alright. Your next opponent is beside four flowers. I think that's the one way up. Wow, yeah, we can see them now. We can see their blonde hair up there. Are they are they the beauty class, I'm gonna guess, because of the blonde hair? I mean, I'm pretty sure Erica had beauties in her gym. Hm, you found me. Of course I'll battle you. Yeah, that's, um, the giggle makes you definitely think it's a beauty trainer. Yeah. Yep, beauty, Lindsay. All right, biscuit, go burn some more grass. Aw, boo. Look, you've beaten me. Alright, can we go fight Gardenia now? <laughs> There's only our gym leader left. Go on. Don't be afraid. Oh, I'm not. I have a fire horse. You kept me waiting. I'm Eterna's gym leader, Gardenia, the Grass-type master. When I first saw you, I was convinced you'd find your way to me. My hunch was right on the money. You have a winning aura about you. So, anyway, this will be fun. Let's have our battle. Gym leader Gardenia. Leading off with a Sharubi. Easily gonna get burned alive. Go, Fire Horse! Burn him, Biscuit, with Flame Charge! Ah, A sliver of health left. Grass Knot? 
Uh, yeah, that doesn't do too much to us. The poison is really a big threat. Hmm. Don't like that. Biscuit's probably going to be pulled out. Uh, oh, a super potion! Will that full heal you? Yeah, okay, so Sherby's not going to die here. But you did waste your turn. How about you still take the poison damage? Shoot. I was thinking I'd be able to have Biscuit last uh, until Gardenia's second Pokemon as well, but considering the Super Potion, yeah, she's going to use another one. Ah, damn it. We'll have to return po uh, Biscuit after Sherubi is done. Damn. That's unfortunate. It's really unfortunate that we keep not just... Ah, oh, oh, just barely not enough damage. Thankfully, though, we can survive one more poison. She's out of Super Potions. And we hit first. Alright, what are you sending out next? We know it's a grass type. Yeah, Biscuit, it's time to come home. Turtwig, okay. Uh, let's go for... You know, we haven't used Pennywise at all yet. Let's send out Pennywise. They don't know what he uh, flying type means, but it should be fine. We'll just use Shadow Ball. Grass type moves will be not very effective against us. It was either going to be um, Pennywise or it was going to be Melina. Oh, you lost special defense? That's a shame. Reflect? Doesn't that raise your special defense for the whole team? No, physical moves. Oh, you made a mistake. I'm not using physical moves, kid. And our final Pokemon is a Rose Raid! Ah, oh, love a Rose Raid. It's not the end yet. Rose Raid looks like a masked hero to me. And I, I like it a lot. Petal Blizzard? Oof. Alright, yeah, I'm glad it went with the not very effective. Oh, Stun Spore? Rude. I don't like that. I don't like that at all. Are you saying something? You think you have a chance? I sure do. Is Petal Blizzard the one that... You'll get confused afterwards. It might be. Oh, nope, doesn't matter. I got you a Shadow Ball, you're dead. I don't think it is, actually. I don't think Petal Blizzard is the confusing one. Ooh, almost everybody leveled up. Yes, Lopler's Double Kick. Hell yes. Uh, let's lose Defense Curl. Anybody else gonna learn anything cool? Biscuit learns agility? Uh, no. No. You got Flame Charge. You don't need agility. Amazing! You're very good, aren't you? I like when the gym leaders are excited for us. Like they want to see the, tr they want to see the trainers that challenge them succeed, but they can't. But they have to make them like actually fight for it. I might have said it before, but you're really tough. Wasn't it hard for you to raise your Pokemon to be so good? Not really. I guess that's a measure of how much you love your Pokemon. In recognition of that, I proudly grant you this. The Force Badge. Might be my favorite of the uh, Sinnoh badges, honestly. It's got a good design. Ooh, but the Ice Badge, though. 
With the Forest Badge, the Hidden Move Cut will be available for your Pokatch. Now that you have two Gym Badges, all Pokemon you received in trades will obey you up to level 30. I've also got something else for you. These are a gift from me. Stickers! And Team 86, which is... What? What is Team 86? Each Team 86 contains Grass Knot. It's one of my favorite moves. The heavier the opposing Pokemon, the more damage this move will cause. Ah, uh, yes. Well, that's our second gym badge. Now that we can use Cut, we can go do a few things. Does he say anything for us winning in this game? Oh, Santa! You have beaten the gym leader. Y'all Pokemon look much tougher than when they went in, too. At least that's how I see it. Thanks, gym guy. Alright, let's go heal up. I'm not sure who I want to have lead the team. I'm not sure if we're still going to biscuit lead. I need to check everybody's levels. Not sure when everybody levels up either. I think Magnemite will be the next one to level up unless, um, or Mercury the Magnemite, unless, uh, Lop is getting a lot of friendship real quickly, which is possible. Uh, let's actually lead with Lop. Because the more battles Lop participates in, the more friendship they'll get. Alright, and then we're going to go back over here on Route 205. I don't think there's anything... Was there anything up here for Cut to... For me to use cut on, I don't think there was. No, yeah, there's not. But there is some stuff down here. No, well, not not down there. Over here, it's the place where you could completely skip Eternal Forest. Is there anything that we would get from here? If there's any, oh, there are some berries. Let's see, we got some raspberries. I was realizing I didn't call out what berries that we collected in two episodes ago. Block berries. Whatever they were, I mean, they were on the screen. So you could see them. I just didn't say them out loud because I wasn't thinking about it. I was probably talking about something. Or and berries. And I'm guessing, yes, these are cherry berries here in the middle. Yep, cherry berries. Alright, is that a trainer to fight, or is that just an NPC to talk to? Oh, so you know about capsule decoration too? Then I'll give you these stickers. Leaf sticker bees. Uh, there's a honey tree. And there's the other cut trees that we could use to um, have completely skipped already turn to forest. What? What's here? A pile of silver powder. Okay. And Team 82, Sleep Talk. Alright, well, uh, that was all that was in this area. So let's go back to Eternal Forest. And actually thinking about it, when we get in here, we're not going to have Lop the team. Because... Reasons. Let's cut down these trees. Hmm, this is an old looking building. Welcome to the old chateau. Let's put Biscuit back in the lead. Actually, let's put Mercury in the lead, because we haven't used them yet. So yeah, there's just this, you know, this creepy, creepy looking mansion. Or chateau, rather. And it's full of Ghastlies. This is why Lop is not really on the team, because Lop will not be able to do anything to ghost types. It's fine. Spark! Someday I will use a Gengar. It's probably not going to be this game, because we've already got Drifloon and we've got a Miss Drevis. Don't think it'll be in this game, but I really want to use a Gengar someday. Ooh, an old Gato. Pokemon magazines. Pokemon Pal, Pokemon Handbook, adorable Pokemon. 
There's so many. A lot of rooms here. The dread plate. Ooh. There's text engraved on the back of the plate. When the universe was created, its shards became this plate. There is one plate for each Pokemon type. And they can be used as held items to increase uh, your ability to use each type of move. Silver Powder is Bug. And which you don't really have anybody for that. Dread plate. Oh, that's Dark type. I was thinking it was Ghost. Uh, we don't have anybody to use that on yet. It's chock full of Pokemon books and photo collections. I feel like there might be something on one of these bookshelves, which is why I'm checking them. I can't remember where or what. Oh. Oh, is this No, I don't I don't want to I don't want to do that. I want to save the game. The TV has an oddly malevolent feel. It's as if it is staring. Okay, I guess we can't do anything with that yet, and that's just something that we'll do later on. Not sure how much later, but not right now, I guess. Ghastly. Hypnosis? Oh, good, we avoided it. Thank God. That would have been a big pain in the ass. Oh, uh, we could catch the ghastly. Just to have one. Hmm, what do we want to name this ghastly? The gas Pokemon. It's a Pokemon born from poison gases. It defeats even the largest foes by enveloping them in gas. Let's... we can go with, uh... Hmm. I got. Some, sometimes I struggle to come up with a name for things, and this is. We've had, we've had this a couple times. Let's go for. God, the names I'm wanting are just like no, I don't. For other reasons, I don't want to do that. Fucking how about. Screw it, Sasha. I got, I got, I got nothing. I got nothing. I feel like we probably used Sasha as a name in a previous LP, but it wasn't one of our Elite Four members, and that's the important thing. Anything in this bookshelf? Color for binders. Can we rest in the beds? No. Okay. They will not let me pull a Goldilocks. What? Oh, there's a. Where'd that little girl go? Creepy. Well, she's not here. TM90 substitute. I know there's supposed to be something with this TV. I just don't know if, if that's later in the game or maybe it's only in Platinum. Not sure. Wonder actually if I can find out quickly enough. Ah, I think it's the National Pokedex. That's when there will be something cool here. That explains it.
Nope. For some reason we went into that room. Oh, I think I was. I think I think I probably thought that was the TV room. And I was gonna go check it out again, but nope, there ain't nothing there. Nothing in the trash can. Chocolate Pokemon books and photos. What about these? Eh, it's the same thing. There's nothing in this library. All right, last room. Oh, uh, your dining table is a little dirty. You got, you got a lot of stains and some pretty big ones. It's kind of embarrassing, guys. Take better care of your house. All right, anything in the kitchen? We got some trash cans. Hey, we got an antidote. Nice. I think that's everything there is to get here in the old chateau for now. I'm just gonna explore the rest of this room, then get the hell out. Mercury doesn't need to escape. Thank you for using Mean Look. I can just use Spark and kill you. Although I guess I gotta use it twice because you have too much HP. Damn it. And nothing over here. Alright, well, we can leave. After these battles. <laughs> I kind of wish it was more than just gas. He's like, put a couple other ghost types in here. Or, uh... If, if they added in Pokemon from future generations into these remakes, I would have been like, hey, Clefkey could have been a good Pokemon to put here. Or, uh... Trubbish. But they didn't do that. Not that you really expect them to, but... I feel like it would have helped the old Chateau instead of just being only Ghastly's. Could at least put in, like, um, Murkrow and Misdreavus, since they're in Eternal Forest, and they kind of make sense. You know, like, a crow Pokemon, they're like, kind of pick the house clean of its shinies, and then another kind of ghost. Should have been fine. But whatever. Not a big deal. Alright, but that's the old Chateau. One last fight. All right, what you got for me? Still, uh, Cascoon. All right, let's cut down this tree again, and then get back to Eterna. All right, everybody. Well, I think we're going to go ahead and end things here. Uh, and then next time, well, we know that the bike shop person went to the Galactic Building. And you need to cut in order to go into the Galactic Building. So, we're going to the Galactic Building next time. See you then, everyone. Bye!